Hello St. Louis Cardinals fans. If you don't want to miss the latest news Louis Cardinals, subscribe to this channel now because we are always aware of the latest news. The St. Louis Cardinals may look different by the time September rolls around. St. Louis has had a roller coaster of a season, and the 2023 campaign still has plenty of time to go. The Cardinals currently are in last place in the National League Central with a subpar 24-32 record but have started to look like the team that was expected in May. St. Louis is just five and a half games behind the NL Central leading Milwaukee Brewers and has plenty of time to make up the ground. The 2023 MLB trade deadline is set for August 1 and there are sure to be plenty of rumors swirling around the Cardinals. St. Louis starting rotation could use a boost, and plenty of names already have been floated that could help. Plus, the Cardinals have some intriguing trade pieces of their own. Although they may not be in first place right now, it sure doesn't sound like St. Louis is giving up, according to Bally Sports Jim Hayes. If you don't want to miss the latest news, subscribe to this channel now because we are always attention to the latest news from St. Louis Cardinals. I don't anticipate us selling at all, Cardinals president of baseball operations John Moziliak said to Hayes. I think, where our division is headed, it's going to remain very competitive. So really we're going to be looking at ways that can really help this club. The trade deadline is sure to be busy and St. Louis could find exactly what it needs. If the Cardinals want to improve their starting rotation, star hurlers like Eduardo Rodriguez, Lucas Gelito, or even former Cy Young Award winner Shane Bieber could all be potential options. St. Louis outfielder Tyler O'Neill has been in trade rumors seemingly all season and the club has other pieces like Juan Yepes who could be packaged together to get a deal done along with other prospects. St. Louis may be eight games below .500, but when the season is all said and done that likely won't be the case, and a potential trade deadline addition certainly could help.